Hi, this is Dave from Dr. Toy Store. I'm here today to talk to you about keeping good care of your auto place. Today we're going to use uh, M9 as a good example of how to properly take care of your auto place. Some do's and don'ts. First off, let me show you this. This is what a normal heat element should look like on the bottom of your autoclave. And here is a heat element of somebody who recently came in to have the autoclave repaired. As you can see, it's warped, messed up. <laughs> it clearly no longer works properly. Now, the way that happened is actually because of poor maintenance. While they did clean the autoclave, they did two big mistakes that a lot of people end up doing. Now, first things first, when you open up your mid-mark uh, M9 autoclave, or even the M11, they're both very similar, um, you will see that usually they have some trays in here, and most people, all they do is take out the trays. What they don't realize is they just take a little flat header or a little screwdriver, go like this, they can take out the whole tray holder. And then once I take out this whole tray holder, you will see on the bottom of this autoclave, the heat element. Now, the way these people messed up the heat element was after they were clean, done cleaning it, since they never took off the bottom, all those chemicals and stuff stayed right here on the bottom, which caused the entire autoclave to completely rust up, uh, caused the heat element to warp and become bad. So you don't want to do that. So you want to make sure that when you do use like autoclave cleaners, such as the tuck cleaner or even the Omni Clean, which are two big brands, one's for Midmark, one's for Tutton Hours, that you go ahead and you make sure that you wipe down everything once you're done. And then once you're done wiping it down with like, really just with a towel, make sure it's nice and clean, rinse it out. You wanna go ahead and put some stainless steel cleaner in. You wanna spray the whole thing down with stainless steel cleaner. Now many people ask me, why do you put this stainless steel cleaner on there? I ask them, do you wax your car? They say, no, there's a hole in my hood. Well, that's why there's a hole in your hood because this thing acts as a wax. This keeps it nice and protected so you don't have to come in here, pay thousands of dollars for repairs. So if you wanna keep your uh, autoclave safe and clean, just go ahead, just make sure you clean it, make sure you take out all the tray holders, make sure that there's nothing there, wipe it down, rinse it, and just do it once a month. Don't use too much cleaner because using too much is gonna cause problems. This is David with some knowledge for you at Dr. Toy Store. Call 877-DRS-TOYS if you need any more info. Please subscribe to our channel. Real news for real doctors.